you're here on TPT Video. It's the first English vlog on this channel. So guys, today I'm in Plotsland Dipan in Belgium, of course my home country. And we're, I'm currently in line for the ride to happiness. Now, one thing is sure, it's gonna be a long way today. The park is incredible busy at the park entrance when we came off the train. It was incredible how many people get off that train. It was incredible. But I'm now in line for the ride to happiness. And this one operates now on one train. So I don't know how long it's gonna take to get on the train. So I will inform you guys how long we wait today for the ride to happiness. But I hope it isn't too long. Um, Mac is also working, I think today at the second train because the train the first train has been stuck on the top hat of right to happiness because of the complications with the train so that train has been dismantled now and after all that I hope to see the train back in June so it's ready for the the main season so I hope you, that one will be on track by the time but now it's time for the rides to the happiness yeah fun. so guys we're now 20 minutes in line and we just moved from right over there just above Enzo's head <laughs> to here so like this that's been 20 minutes <laughs> oh my god so I'm now in the station of right to happiness after almost 40 minutes it will be more I think uh, I'm in the station, so yeah, I'm about to ride again for the more, like, I've ridden the station for more than 700 times now, but like, almost 800 times, so yeah. Guys, let's be honest, this ride has changed a lot. Like the forces, the airtime, it's insane now. Like this ride was before an insane ride. But now, the forces that you feel when you run into the banana roll, then into the loop, they are incredible. I've never experienced something like that before. And, other, and the other thing, the airtime on this last two airtime hills and the normally no airtime hill has airtime. Like also the twisted airtime hill before the second launch, that one has airtime now too. So. I'm really, really, really surprised in a positive, in a positive way that Mac Rides has fin finally fixed the problem of the ride to happiness. Like this thing, it's honestly very hard for another coaster ride thing to beat this one. We have to go right there. Let's go there and so, let, yeah, let's go, yeah. We go now to the Like Me coaster, the brand new, or actually the re-themed coaster of 2022. Uh, to see what they've changed. Uh, I followed the deconstruction. Um, so I'm really, really excited to see the result. Um, but yeah, the ride to happiness, it's incredible, guys. It's incredible. So guys, we arrived now at the brand new Like Miko. So this one looks actually very, very, very good. When you compare it to the previous queue line of this thing. Um, this one is incredibly updated now. So I'm really, really, really excited to see everything. Let's go right there. Oh, that's nice, guys. This is an upgrade. This is a very much upgrade. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah. Like it a lot. Go. <laughs> oh. Get my ticket. <laughs> Get my bust. <laughs> oh, here we go, guys. I'm about to break my back. Yeah guys, this thing will never be so 
guys, we're about to ride Anubis the ride. Yeah, guys, this uh, Gerslauer lounge coaster opened back in 2009 and it's one of the smoothest Gerslauers out there. Um, even though it's aged, it's like, how old is it now? 2009, 13 years old, 13 years old. And this thing rides very smooth for its age. So we're about to ride it. It's a fun ride. Nothing special compared to Ride to Happiness. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna ride it anyway. Uh, it was my favorite ride, or one of my favorite rides, to operate here in the park. Um, I've worked here for five years and I quit in December of 2021. Um, and I'm about to uh, go to Disneyland Paris in June. The end of June I'm starting in Disneyland Paris. Um, so yeah, that's the whole thing now. So we're about to ride. A new is around. How long is the queue? Oh, it's not here. That's fine. Oh, it's uh, the, the switchback. I think it's just the switchback now. No, not here. Yeah, just two switchbacks um, and the stairs and another stairs and two switchbacks. It's fine. I think it's so uh, 30 minutes. Yeah, 30 minutes, something like that. So we just come off right, uh, Anubis the ride. I'm going, I was going to say right to happen. <laughs> no, not no, no, the not the same. So we did uh, Anubis. Uh, we waited uh, like how, 30 minutes. Yeah, 30 minutes for that. Oh, love this. Yeah, love to ride to happiness. Um, it was fine, uh, the launch was good, uh, the airtime was great, um, but yeah, the rest of the layout is not something special. The twin brakes uh, still suck, <laughs> they suck, um, but we're now heading to the next new thing for 2022, and that's uh, the Dunkin' Donut in the, in, the, in the glass box, in the glass box. We're going to the glass box of Dunkin' Donuts. So now we're walking past Wikiland, uh, which opened in 2013 uh, with a Zamperla Disco, a large version. Oh, those guys are like having fun. <laughs> um, and a Max Splash Battle. Um, I don't know if we're gonna do one of these today. Um, basically because uh, they have a long wait and they're not something special. And I've been here a lot, a lot, a lot of times. So I basically have done everything uh, multiple times already. Um, but Ride to Happiness, I want to do that, uh, that thing at least two times more today. Um, and tomorrow I'm at Wallaby Belgium, also with Enzo. Um, so it's gonna be a fun day tomorrow as well. But yeah, it's gonna be crazy. Oh, it's, it's heading for the Bunny Hill. Yeah, Bunny Hill. Which, which, what do you call that thing? <laughs> uh, airtime, an airtime hill without airtime. <laughs> so guys, we're now heading to the Dunkin' and I will show you the donuts that we bought. Um, and also the construction of the Boompa Circus, the new zone for 2023. So guys, we have the donuts. We have them. Woohoo! So I picked the Plopsalam one, the Lotus Sensation and the normal Oreo one. Um, I will show the donuts in a second when we arrive at uh, Ride to Happiness. But honestly, I don't think that this thing fits in Plops Hub. This container doesn't fit at all in the spark. It ruins the whole thing. If you would like put it in this thing, it would fit. Then it would fit. But now, but now in this stupid container, it looks ugly. It is ugly. <laughs> And it doesn't fit in the park. So guys, fix it or remove it. One of those, please. So these are the donuts that we got. The Plopsalam one, a Oreo with something else, a Kit Kat, Lotus, a strawberry one, and a normal Oreo one. So let's taste it with a view. We just did uh, the Rise of Happiness two more times, but because of the wait time from almost one hour, uh, we lost already two hours just in line uh, for the Ride to Happiness. But every ride on the Ride to Happiness stays one of the best rides in the world. So it was completely worth it um, to wait for the Ride to Happiness. And now we're heading towards Maya Land uh, because we want to ride the flower carousel in English. Uh, in Dutch, Bloemenmolen. Um, so we're gonna ride that thing. It's the most interesting ride in this park 
because of the lyrics of the song in the ride. There is also onboard audio in that ride, which makes it very interesting. So I'm gonna see you guys when we're over there. So guys, I really have big, big trouble with the new fast pass system here in the park. Um, the ride to happiness is currently at one train. Um, because the second train uh, ha has its problems, it has been stuck on the top hat. Um, but now, with the fast pass and one single train, the capacity of the ride to happiness is unbelievable low. And it's a big, big problem that Popsa has to solve. Because now, um, we've waited almost a, uh, an hour and a half for our ride plus we had to catch the train and now we missed it because there was a whole lot of people with the fast pass which makes uh, to dispatch the train in five minutes like five minutes to dispatch the train because they have to check every single uh, person on the fast pass uh, uh, and also uh, to put them on the train and everything which makes that the capacity of the right to happiness is unbearably low. It's something I'm not, not, not positive about. <laughs> and I hope that Plopsa will solve this problem in time. I hope they fix it before the start of July, uh, the main season of the theme park uh, season. Um, and yeah, let's hope they can fix it. Otherwise, it won't be fun to come over here. Um, when it's a day like today, with a lot of fast passes, a lot of people in the park, multiple um, rides to happen on one train, it's not fun to come here. No. So this makes our end today here at Plopsaland Dipan. Uh, this was our first visit in the 2022 season here. Um, our day was quite good, but also not totally good uh, because of the fast pass system. Um, which is not good at all, uh, especially at the Rides of Happiness. But overall, we had a good day. Um, we had a lot of fun. Uh, there was a lot of crowd today in the park, so it was pretty busy, but we had a lot of fun. And now, before I end this video, we're walking toward... Oh yeah, I see the dog, the bogen. A car from MacRides because MacRides is currently working at the second train of the Ride to Happiness, so that's why they're here. So the car is parked on the parking lot of Plopsa and Dipan. If you're at the park, go check if the car is here and you can take a picture with it. Uh, you will see this car not often, so if you want, you can take a picture with it. But guys, that was the video for today. I hope you all liked it. It was my first English vlog here on the channel. There will be more. Uh, tomorrow I'm going to Wallaby Belgium as well. And there will be an English vlog as well. So I hope you all liked it. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.